Hi, uh, this is Dr. Yates and what we're talking about today, this was a, another FUE procedure that we did. And what we did, if you can come around with the camera to the back of his head, all the way around, all the way around. We just went in the nape of the neck down here and got around a thousand grafts. He's had a previous, he's had two procedures done before, if you can see back here. He's had a total of 4,000 grafts, but his hair is shaved pretty tight and you can't even tell that he's had any work done. So we went down in the nape of the neck just to reinforce the hairline to get very fine hair. So if you come around the front. We'll take a look at this. <clears throat> so you can see, this is his picture <clears throat> before he started with us. Okay? Of course his hair is shorter, but you can see that he didn't have much hair here at all. So if you can just hold that. And if you can come in with the camera, as you can see what we've done today, we've kind of augmented the hairline, bringing it down, feathering it, it feathering it, and kind of reinforcing more of this left side because he parts his hair on the left side so we're kind of cheating over there to give him more boost of density that way as the hair falls this way. You can see from the first procedure where, well the first two procedures where he didn't have much hair in here at all, he's now regained a lot of hair, a lot of density. Now you must remember his hair is wet now so when his hair is dry it's going to look twice as thick. So it's wet now, so this is the thinnest his hair looks. Uh, trust me, when his, when his hair is dry, it looks quite thick and quite dense. So we added a thousand grafts here, right in front of the hairline here, with one hairs and two hairs, just to kind of make this even more, give it more pop so it stands out. So what do you think about today's procedure? Was it just like the rest? You've had all of them now. You've had FUE, you've had the artist, you've had, I, today I did the FUE because it was down at the nape of the neck, which is hard for the artist to do. So, you know, I do it myself all the time. I mean, what, what do you think about your hair now so far from where you've come from something like this? I'm what getting do you think? used to the procedures now. You know, uh -huh. It's much comfortable and mm -hmm. uh, there is uh, no pain. I didn't take as usual, no painkillers. Right. And I was very comfortable. The procedure was very quick and I am very impressed with the hairline that you put down here, the peak that you did, and also you fill these areas that were showing the receding lines, you know. I'm feeling perfect, perfect. What were you feeling about it before? I mean, you've made a lot of progress since this now, I mean. Well, of course, because uh -huh. these areas, I was more, much more concerned about it because mm -hmm. it was showing the baldness, you know, so I had to part my hair this way or that well, way. Well, you didn't have much hair. Exactly. Uh -huh. So these areas, when the light was reflecting, you know, it was shinier. Now I got more hair, more density. And the best thing I love is, you know, the hairline that you put down now, the soft hairline, yeah. which I can part my hair any way I like. Right. That's the best thing and whichever way I can style it. Right. And no one's ever said, hey, have you had a hair transplant? No. That you didn't tell. Nobody I mean, ever noticed, you know, they say, they don't believe me actually when I say, when I show my the pictures, they say, you're lying or whatever, this is your natural hair, you know, like, nobody believes this is a transplanted hair. Whereas transplanted hair I've seen in other people, it's like con rows, you know, separated always, and also, you know, like uh, they show the plugs at the roots. Right, but here that was the old style, though. Yeah, in, in but uh, nobody noticed that I got a head transplant. Good. And the best thing about it is, it looks natural, and the back is pristine. He can wear his hair short, and it looks great. So everyone knows that, you know, I do FUE. I, I don't do many strip operations at all. Um, that's just a personal choice. But you can see his hair is shaved all the way down. He's had 4,000 grafts removed from the back of his head. And you cannot tell. Yeah, when I, if I look at his head like this, even like this, and I know what to look for, I'm still, it doesn't scream at me that he's had an FUE procedure. So a lot of people who are talking about seeing a lot of dots and this and that, I think it's an over-exaggeration, okay? Obviously, he still has good density and that helps. But I think, you know, we've hit a home run with this one. Of course, he's happy. I'm happy too. So what we'll do is we'll just see you back in six months. We'll show his results and we'll take it from there. This is Dr. Yates. Thank you.